Yo, when you click like, it helps me help my daughter. This is one of John, John Stupid's works. I was gonna say, this is a job. I was like, I hope you didn't buy this. I got a couple of good ideas and I got a couple of bad ideas, both of which are gonna be going in on your property. <laughs> you gotta take the good with the bad with contracting. That's what I've realized over the years. Immediately, step one, what's going on? What's going on right here? Like there's a step. Why am I walking in the steps? What's with the grade? Another great staircase. Let's step up, step down. Step up, change the floor. Little jig jag. This is what we do here. Wow, look at this shit. Damn. I was gonna do the whole ceiling, but I figured, why not a, 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 a trapezoidal uh, picture frame? <laughs> trapezoidal picture frames. We Track lighting. Look at that light fixture, that's cool. I got this on sale at Home Depot for $49.99. It was in style 15 years ago, kind of. Okay, kind of. Wow, we got more steps. Hold, up. Hold the phone, Chris. <laughs> this is some great stuff. Wow, let, it, let look him at the cook. on the wall. Yeah, let him cook. Man, we got the Home Depot plot. Oh, wow, really dress up. Look at that Victorian style casing. Oh, beautiful. Let's run the flooring up, over, and down. Now that's something that's cool. I love all the steps. It's like a big magic bathtub. <laughs> wow, awesome. Cool. <laughs> Great job on the tile flooring. Look at that. I bet you there's something special on the stairs. Cool. Something that'll trip you going up. Yeah, <laughs> nails. Loose screws. Wow, two different kinds of base. Oh, it looks great. It's like an optical illusion. Just materials on materials. Make sure there's covering everywhere. You gotta box something in? It's just simple, just box it in. More, box it in here too. <laughs> oh, air conditioning unit, take a nice, that's a great picture. You see your real estate, it's great. Who's that, is that Kathy stupid? Hey Kathy, how's the year treating ya? Good. <laughs> I love what you did with the AC unit from the fucking more. Is that a security camera? Yeah, it is. Security camera. Exposed. How wires dangling. Aw, oh, nice. Looking good, my man. Let's lay that bitch down. <laughs> yeah, why don't we hang it from bungee cords? <laughs> super, super. Aw, oh, more trapezoidal trapezoidal picture framing. Uh, ceiling. Shit. Look at this shit. What the? What in the fucking holy hell were you thinking, Uncle John Stupid? Ooh, we more flooring. Coffee maker area. Cool. Yeah, it's a, that's a, that's what we actually call it. a little barista, a little uh, little little coffee zone. You know, wake you up in the morning. Super coffee. Get the no job lighting. Off. You just like in a dark. Yeah, you, no plug. There's, yeah, there's no plug. Yeah, most people actually use an AeroPress anyway, so you can just use your. You don't need electricity for an AeroPress. You can get the hot water and walk it around here. Oh, just box it in. Have something. Just box it in. This Great. is really bad. This yeah, is this worst is the worst I've thing I've ever. ever, ever seen. This is a nice piece of shit. Wow, cool. I love Clean that. Clean microwave. There was something above it. There was a double oven hole. Actually, I got a deal on the cabinet. It was the double oven cabinet. Now, this is the, just so we're all on the same page. This is the cheapest kitchen cabinet you can get. These cabinets right here are $60 a piece. 60 This one's $89. This one up here is $69. This one's only uh, $75. This one's uh, $62. This one, the single job is $42. And then this big one is 190 bucks. That's but he didn't have picture. a unit. He just put a regular old Panasonic microwave. And then the he put carpet. a piece of aluminum. <laughs> yeah, I put a piece of aluminum. Oh, wow. This is a great piece of shit you have here. Wow, this is great. Oven's clean. Oh, nice fridge. Fits good. Whirlpool. Good looking wall there. Built out of two by three. Man, this guy knew what was up. Great looking furniture. That's not Dominican whore furniture. <laughs> That's not at all. I promise. I swear to God, it's not. <laughs> but let's put a soffit in with just two recessed lights. Not the whole thing, just a couple. That's crazy. Jeez Louise. Got a little bar set up for you. Shake up a few cocktails. Some milk and uh, Sam Adams. <laughs> nice. Let's change the floor midway with an aluminum threshold. Nice two. Oh, this looks great too. Dude. More shit. What in the whole? Oh, nice to hide the door. Uh, little. That's, that's a mechanical room where I put the. Uh, look at that. Oh, they took the washer and dryer out. This is this is a little wash unit I put in. Wow. Look at that. Holy shit. Look at the doors. Like, look at this, like, dumb shit like this. Like, just to dress up the door a little bit, I just did a little bit, a little box molding. Fucking idiot. This is the worst house I've seen while doing this. This is, this is the worst, this is the worst house. Look at the lighting fixtures and shit. Missouri. Yeah, this is, this is the dumbest piece of shit. Like, a mantle with a mirror without trim above, track lighting, recess cans, light fixtures. Cork, cork board, board uh, yeah, cork board or ce cedar. Those are cedar war, war uh, cedar panels. I did that actually as a finish for a closet in one of the houses. Um, look at the skylights. Look at the, the the design of the skylights. Holy shit! Truly a John stupid masterpiece. How long has it been a market? I actually sold the um, uh, the Bolecki. This is the Bolecki home. I sold them the plans in early 16. They ended up finishing it out just in time in late 2021. This is my, um, wow. 
And this guy thought he was doing something great every step of the way. This is truly a house that, like, look at the levels. Like, all the floors are always off. Just clad it with everything. Just make sure it's covered. Holy shit. What a, what a piece, what a human piece of shit. It's the worst house ever. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, South Bend. Now, that is... Thank you. You have a special eye for pointing out treasures. Just treasures. Damn. That's a total teardown. Oh, wow. Look at the stairs in the middle of the... Oh, my God. Look at that. What's that? That's a drive. That's a... Uh, dude, the driveway's got to go 10 feet up in the air. What else? I'm going to put stairs between the tire tracks. Don't go down it. I'll blow your... Yeah. Imagine, imagine. Let me get the motorcycle up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just down like... Oh! That's insane. Damn. That's the, that's the most insane shit... Like, I think that's interior trim on the exterior, too. Like, like this, like, look at this shit. That's crazy. That's fencing. This that's is like that's a, a picket fence for, for uh, the Juliets. Holy shit. It's like a Sims house. Like where you, yeah. tr truly the worst house yeah. uh, that's ever been on here. Damn. And this, let me tell you something. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. You want to see some more mistakes? You ready to see 375 mistakes in 25 minutes? <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> Follow me. Kathy's stupid. So, note on this house is, uh, Hi, John. Have to sell the house you built me. I lost it all on John Wayne memorabilia. I knew it. Hope you like what I done with the place. This one? Yep. Oh, man. I built this beauty. I called it the archway. The archway to heaven. I hope you guys like, like, uh, hemispheres. <laughs> you guys like half circles? Do you guys like me gold too. geometry? Look at this one. Look, uh, even the cabinet's a hemis uh, hemisphere, a demi-loon. Oh, man. Can't believe you're losing the place. We just got done doing the tin ceiling on the backsplash with the Corian countertops and the Tiffany-style lamp. It's a shame that when you were selling it, you didn't feel like putting away, you know, the stuff on top of the fridge or the stuff on top of the everything. Whoa, you should have put some of that stuff away, bud. What? Huh? That's my little loft up there. <laughs> I go up there and I read a nice book. It doesn't make any noise. I can only afford the railings for the entrance of the stairs. It doesn't, it doesn't make any noise when I walk up on top of a piece of plywood in the middle of my living room. <laughs> it's cool. It's like a little reading nook that I put above the glass block entryway. This is some of the features that you can get on an advanced package at the John Stupid Construction Company. No, the jukebox is not included. No, the Wurlitzer, that's coming with me. Thanks, <laughs> bub. Unless you're ready to pay me over 900 grand for it. Wow, that's a great... That's a great stove and a nice 10 point buck. Good photo placement. Oh yeah. Very normal human right there. I like the way you did a, uh, hey, let's put a fucking, a, a bedroom dresser with a flat screen in the I like watching room. TV from the other couch like this. <laughs> I like looking over my shoulder at the TV. Hey Chris, check this out. Oh. Ah! He collects uh, numbered bean pots or uh, what, are, what are these fuck? Stoneware jugs. A pickle crock. Mm. A stoneware jug. We got a real antique guy here. Beer growlers everywhere. Oh man, what a great little reading. Oh though. my god. That's cool. You can play video games and sweat. This is a great place to come up here and sweat. Great little layout. Snoopy. All the gangs here. Oh cool. More pieces of the furniture that you got at uh, uh, Walmart. Nice uh, stained glass light fixture. Dehumidifier. That's a good sign. Always a good sign. You got some more no rugs. Nice rehab looking room for drug rehabilitation center. This is on... Real. Ugh. Yeah, this house is a, sle this is a sleaze bag house. It is a John. Oh. oh, no way. Yeah, dude, look. look An at above that. ground indoor. It's a lap pool, Chris. <laughs> That's how we stay in shape. <laughs> I bought this from an infomercial. Jesus. These Christ. are sold on the infomercial. Honestly, the best way to do it is just to call the 1 800 number and then buy the lap pool on the infomercial. They're nineteen thousand uh, dollars. Uh, three times. It's a, they have a stretch pay. <laughs> three times. Stretch pay. Oh my god. Yeah, a sauna and a lap pool. Jesus it's Christ. It's got full sauna. Beautiful. Nice, well-maintained uh, mailbox built by even more engineering Boy genius. Scouts. We've got 8-inch uh, PVC pipe, uh, oh duct tape on god. the end with a, uh, a cool uh, yard sale find on your house. What a Ooh. great home. Oh, it's in, and the land's in great shape. See, you took care of everything? Oh, I see you bought a Kubota in 2000. Oh, this guy's a moron. That's incredible. Whoa, what? the fuck what's what is that? that is that an underground fucking bunker wow it's got a lot of cool outbuildings holy shit what the fuck is that target practice target uh. practice he's a shooter wow what the fuck is up with that underground bunker well, how do they explain that it was, eight, it was built into a hill this? oh it's a natural roof I understand oh it's cool it's actually built 
Oh. Real talk, I actually love that. Okay, so that's a shot from the back. Oh, that's cool. Underground house. Yeah, underground house. Damn, he built it. 450? Hmm. Make me look at it twice. Hmm. That's oh. crazy. It's cursed, though. It's Yeah, it's cursed because the, the world's fucking stupidest prick lived there before. Yeah, it's a shame that it's so bad. Damn. Oh, they're really dark. I didn't know they were that dingy. I, I didn't know that living underground in a hole cut out of the side of a mountain could be so dingy. That could have been something that I... I better tore one before I decide to build one. I just had to wait my whole life to build one and then realize it's fucking... It smells like wet piss in here. It smells like someone like a 70-year-old man pissed yellow piss into a set of underwear and then like slapped it onto a concrete ground and then left it there for two years and that's what my house smells like forever. <laughs> What? Illinois. So I found out this was designed by John Stupid Architecture, LLC. Oh, no way. My uncle, he was an equestrian. <laughs> he was, uh, he was into, um, masturbation. <laughs> <laughs> My uncle was, uh, into, um, what, what's the word for horseback riding? Masturbation. <laughs> uh, yeah, this does look, oh, three horses running at each other. Uh! <laughs> like, what? Horses wouldn't do that. Why would there be three horses running at each other? <laughs> like, uh, and it's it's not the four it's not the three horsemen it's the four horsemen. Yeah. It's the wow. Three horsemen. What a nice room we did here. Uh, I think. Oh, this is my uncle, Rob. Uh, my uncle from Persia, Rob Salman Al Hafi. Uh, stupid, <laughs> stupid. My uncle. This is, uh, uh, Persian people do shit like this though, typically. Stupid. St st <laughs> stupid. <laughs> I'll stupid. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, Chris, that was good. God damn. God damn it. Yeah, like uh, big couches along the perimeter. That's a very uh, Persian thing. God damn. Look at like I have big bedroom. My brother sold a house like this in uh, in a part of Cranston. It was a uh, twenty thousand square feet, like twelve bedroom, twelve bath, and it was just like. 12 bedrooms. Like, when you look up bedroom, it was bedroom. Like, like, there's no, like, how many couches? 18 couches. How much feet? 90 feet. Everything. Look at bedroom, 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 bedroom. Like, this is awful. Oh. Posse Alfar Sahupid. <laughs> hey, he was a patriot, though. Good for him. He was a, he was a true patriot. This was like a, a, like a, remember that hat from Spencer's that had a, a brim that was this long and it said, I bet you that my hat's bigger than yours? That's what this guy, this guy owned that hat. Like he would get like a, he would like, instead of having like a Lamborghini, he would just like weld three S classes together. <laughs> like, like how about I weld three cars together? <laughs> I win. I win. <laughs> yeah, three is better. Right? Like he would let, he would make his three wives stand on top of each other's shoulders, like stand on top of each other's shoulders. Uh, yeah, this is what, <laughs> this is what like, uh, Nah, who cares? Anyway, dead joke. Who gives a fuck? What's the note on this one? Allen's Creek, Gladstone, Virginia. Hi, John. I love this house you built me, and I was hoping you could come back and install some soundproofing to the guest areas. Don't go into the meat locker. Thanks again. Thanks. Uh, we appreciate your business, John Stupid Contracting. Thank you. No, thank you. You like what I did here? This is one of my masterpieces. <laughs> this is a uh, block foundation with a wood porch and a cement porch on this side. Cement columns on this side. I went with a salmon colored exterior with a nice crisp ocean blue metal roof with a rust toned concrete exterior facade on this side and a, a chocolate brown Neapolitan themed ice cream siding concept that's exclusive to this John Stupid construction. It's the ice cream house. It's, I call it the ice cream home. It's sweet, it'll give you a sweet tooth. <laughs> uh, holy shit. Do you love spiral staircases? Do you love player pianos? Do Me love, too. Do you love banging your head on the bottom of the seventh staircase? <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, I put natural stone, but I actually ran out of the funds when it came to trim. So we're not going to run trim. We'll wait on that. Rome wasn't built in a day, as they love to say. Romans weren't built in a day. We can only fit 32 stars on the flag <laughs> I painted on the wall. I got the star, fl the flag that everyone wants, the 19... 22 flag <laughs> yeah. before Missing Arizona and New Mexico were states <laughs> yeah. in Hawaii. And, and I put some nice portions in there to give you some really great closet space eventually when you put fronts on the closet doors. This is a great wide open plywood floored bathroom and I had enough time to put the vanity in but I forgot about the rest of it. <laughs> Holy shit. I put new mini splits in. I put some excellent heating and ventilation. Nothing else. I was able to put the, the uh, receptacles every eight feet, which is code. And then I put these beautiful shelves in with curtain rods to cover up. 
And then I did a bottle, a cement bottle for an artistic, beautiful, disp- I would love to see them explain this, a real kitchen, a real cook's kitchen. I did. I went to a kitchen auction and I bought stainless steel work tables for $75 a piece. And then I bought a consumer grade vent hood above a commercial grade, uh, oh, I put two stoves just in case you're really cooking. Because <laughs> if we know one thing about the stupids, we're always really cooking. I love the way they put the, you, you're, you're gonna need the fire extinguisher handy yeah. and in the middle of the wall because everything lights on fire in my builds, including the, the reality of logic. <laughs> I put a beautiful coffee cup boiler on the top to let you know it's, it's Java time. It's what Java. I like to say is, but first, coffee. <laughs> uh, open rafters, so you can see the plastic uh, wrap around the uh, insulin. Insulated uh, for your pet bats. <laughs> <laughs> you can hide all your pet bats up there. That's a great. Thank you, Chris. Yeah, that's fucking funny. Pet bats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't let my pet bats out. <laughs> like me, 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 me. Just like, eating yeah, people's yeah. hair. This is a second kitchen where you can sit and watch the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> and I put a college kid fridge in and another stove. There's nothing, nothing cooler than a house with three stoves. It's actually a half washing machine. <laughs> yeah, you could wash your sh- undershorts in the in the uh, in the lower part, and you can Japanese you can cook some macaroni machine. and cheese in the top. Excellent. I got this bookshelf out of an old library, and I hung it up on the wall so you can put your plates in there. And then I was smart enough to wire a lighting fixture above it. Wow, this is absolutely insane! The wow, barn door curtain, a vessel sink with an old fucking copper milk can look at the filthy grout tile work barn door shower curtain a milk can with a custom built half inch copper is that like annealed god damn this house is bad this is what this is the this is one of the worst houses i've ever seen this is fucking yeah. awful i got like all, all john stupid shit it. aside wow look at this barn high pitch cut the fucking metal siding wide open on it they custom made doors for it look at the doors metal roofing panels on top of a two by four frame, and they just said, fuck it, we'll just Let like it shape, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, a walk in freezer outside. Holy shit, dude. Where is this again? This is what? in Retardville. Holy oh, shit, man. man. This isn't even John Stupid. This is Mike Retard. <laughs> yeah, it's a new brand. This is a new guy. John Stupid's the old guy. I'm Mike Retard, and I build houses as big as the eye can see. Blocks, Neapolitan ice cream. I'm right. Re- <laughs> I'm Mike you, Retard. Like, you gotta learn how to great. make your eyes go the other way. Hold on, like this. I can do it. I used to kind of be able to do it. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, I think I learned how to do it. On, believe it or not, I learned how to do that on the Rosie O'Donnell show when I was a kid. You cross your eyes and then you look over there. And then you gotta have the other one look over there. Yeah. Hold on. You gotta. Ah, shit. Damn. Holy shit. This is the. This is some oh, hoop house. Uh, I built this gazebo. Like the time you spelt to build it. This is insane. Like, why did you even frame this thing? He might have... Somebody wow. has to have a, a mental uh, yeah. disorder or something. This is like doomsday prepper shit. There was a time when they had money because these are these doors... Like, there are components in here that like are semi-okay. Like, these double doors. They must have got a deal on them or something. <clears throat> One, two, three. Absolutely insane. Thank you for selling that to me. How much is this? It isn't for sale, is it? Four forty nine. Oh, my God. Unique proper... Formerly a gentleman's farm... Before a fucking retarded guy bought it. Generator and freezer price reflects the needed work. What do you mean? The, the tear down? Holy shit. That's some fucking backwoods fucking, yeah. Are we in uh, Mur- Murray, Kentucky? Yeah, we're in Murray, Kentucky. Uh, toured the other day and it needs literally everything. It has a hundred closets, all of which are cheapo. Not going for it. So it's not just going big... for it. Why is it showing us? I just make sure he wants confirmation that yeah, it was yeah, not yeah. a good. I, I, I'm with you. I'm JK. I'm, I'm, I'm with you. I got it. He wants to. He wants to know. Yeah, it does. It really does. Whoa. Any. Illuminati, big time. Yeah. That's a garage. It's a car garage. Yeah, this house is big for nothing. I hate stuff like this. Yeah, it need, It does need everything. It's big though. It's fucking a monster. Mm. This thing is like how many square feet is this? Sixty two hundred. Yeah. It'll never stop. I mean, this was. This is like. This, like problem number one. Bang right there. This this stone wall just just problems. It's is it on a slab too? Basement. Crawl space, none. It is on a slab. Ah, awful. Big, expensive, stupid staircase. Big. This is, yeah, this is a stupid house. That's a. It's just a big dick show house. That's what this is. Oh, that's big. <laughs> What's going on? You guys know that my house is big. <laughs> yeah. I'm John Big. I'm John Big. <laughs> All right, my voice is big, and I'm John's big. My truck outside is big too. Long bed, crew cab. My wife drives a minivan extension. 
drives a Sprinter van, passenger, nine passenger. My son school bus. My son drives a bus. My son has a school bus. He drives a tandem bicycle with only one person. I have full, I have the, you know those big subs that you can get that are like the size of 10 feet long? I have one. I get one of those every day for lunch. <laughs> I drink a gallon of, uh, I drink a whole pool full of iced coffee. <laughs> I'm John Big. My wife's 15 feet tall. I have three of them. <laughs> I play pool with a stick. I play pool with a telephone pole length stick. <laughs> That's me, John Big. <laughs> I'm really fucking sad inside, though. I was shoved, yeah, I was shoving too many lockers. Uh, I'll be honest with you. My life's not going the way I thought it would. I thought all this big stuff would come back and help me, and I've been pretty fucking miserable for the past <laughs> couple of months. It's me, John Big. <laughs> yeah. His last name is actually Smalls. Yeah. He's, He's like, like the tiniest cock in the big. world. Yeah. Yeah. He has like the most button cock you've ever seen in your life. Yeah, yeah. It's like it's he, tiny. he's got like a miraculous yeah. tiny penis. Yeah, you just had a botch circumcision. <laughs> oh man, I am so fucking sad. Oh hey, John. <laughs> Dude, oh that would suck. Fuck. <laughs> oh my son, he's really big too. I have a dog. He's he's a he's just a horse. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is my like doggy. My dogs. Chocolate Lab. You want to see a picture of my Chocolate Lab? You do? Okay, cool. Here's a picture of him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a good boy. Okay, he's in my big house. It's really big. It's <laughs> awesome. Fucking idiot. I live. Uh, I live near people that talk like that are like that though. Like, yeah, yeah, it's good because he's big. Yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's how fucking Texas was. Yeah, yeah. No shit, right? Like, yeah, I want to live in a Staples. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I live above the Staples uh, slash BJ's slash Chick-fil-A. <laughs> yeah, it's at, uh, yeah, Mariner Bay Seafood yeah. House. Yeah. 